everyone, Abby here with Scrap and Abby, and I have something to share with all of you ladies today. Kind of more, maybe even a little bit of a confessional, but um, I went to the Dollar Tree today for this item and this item alone. My daughter needed some more lead for her pencil um, for schoolwork and such, and I went in to, just to get the lead, and all of this happened. <laughs> I, I don't know what happens. Like these things just like jump into my, my car. I, I can't tell you. I also have some really cool Valentine stuff that I found, but I'm going to do that in a completely separate video. So I thought I would just go ahead and share these items with you ladies. And uh, um, <laughs> I guess I should just give this to my daughter <laughs> so she can get her homework done. So anyway, so I'm going to go ahead and kind of get into this here. So these are some more of the vinyl stickers, the wall creations. This one is Be the Change You Want the World to See. And I love that. It's a really nice positive affirmation. As I've said on my channel before, I love having positive affirmations all around me. So this one's probably going to go in my craft room. Um, we'll see. And then this one is for my daughter's bathroom. She doesn't know yet, but be your own kind of beautiful. Either her bathroom or bedroom, I'm not sure. I'll figure out um, a place for that. And then I grabbed two of these. I don't really have a location for these yet in my house, but I just liked how they looked. And I know these aren't new or anything, because I've seen these at my Dollar Tree, um, I don't know, at least a year or two ago, if not longer. Um, well, at least a year and a half, let me say that. But it looks really pre pretty on the sample there when it's on the wall. So since we're leasing this house, it, um, you know, is nice to have these kind of options so I don't have to worry about, you know, painting or anything like that, which our, um, you know, our, um, landlady, she's totally cool with us painting doing whatever we want, but, you, you know, I just kind of want to reserve that when we actually buy our own home. So here are some little mini hats and I bought these for the sole purpose of putting one on my little Dotson's head so I can take a picture. And they're purple and you get three in a pack so I don't know maybe I'll alter these I'll toss these maybe into my toad up in the garage for different th things that I like to alter and stuff like that so but I, th I thought that was just too cute I know it's total silliness uh let's see here so these are new at least it's my dollar trees and they came on the, they're on the shelves with this bubble wrap little pocket which I think is really cool they're little I'm um, like lanterns it's like a little you know squatty uh, mason jar but it has that kind of faux um Oh, I just, it just slipped my, slipped my mind with this is mercury. There you go. looks like that kind of, it's not like real mercury or anything like dip, like vintage. I'll show you what I'm talking about. Like this here, this is like a real vintage mercury glass, mercury, however you want to say that. And, um, sometimes it's hard for me to enunciate properly because the left half of my face, inclu including the left half of my tongue and my mouth is numb. It feels like you just went to den uh, the dentist and... When that numbness gets real pronounced, it's hard, hard for me to talk properly. So, sorry about that. I really can't say mercury. <laughs> anyway, I thought these were really cute. So, I grabbed four of these. And I think these look, look cute either in my living room or in our bedroom. And they also had another color red, I think. So, if you want to go check that out. I found these on the aisle where they sell the candles and kind of the floral stuff. So, the same end cap with those hats. Um, these are some handheld masks. And I grabbed one purple, and I grabbed uh, the silver white. I don't like this at all. This is definitely not my style at all. But I am going to alter this using some of this component. But this is going to go into what that um, my tote I was telling you about whenever I'm in between projects or whatever. So that's like not something I'm going to be doing too, too soon. Um, I grabbed a couple of these picture hanging kits because I bought a bunch of frames that I shared in another Dollar Tree video, which will go with which will be up before this one is. And then um, these are their different uh, organizers. And um, I like these because it has three fairly good size slots with a lid that snaps on. I know these are inexpensive. They're not the same quality as the ones from like Tuesday morning, TJ Maxx, that kind of thing. But this is for my craft room. So I really don't, you know, I don't need it to be a $25 container. I don't want that. That's money I can spend on craft stuff. <laughs> so this will be perfect for me. And it's just plastic, which is fine. And you can see in the photo there, you can store some different things. So when I'm working on my craft room, this is going to be some additional organization for that. And of course, I will be doing that um, video in that so you ladies can see how I'm going to be doing some various craft room organization. Uh, this is something I found on the aisle. I, I just, I walked past it and I went back down that same aisle in one of the big huge uh, plastic um, like laundry baskets. They must have had like 40 of these and so I grabbed two. I reserved myself. I did not grab the whole basket because <laughs> I certainly don't need that much. But it's the Karen brand and it's, um, it says Simply Baby but you can you know, 
obviously use this for whatever you want. And I love this shade of uh, lavender lilac. So I grabbed a couple of those to use for different craft purposes. And also to, um, when I'm packaging, packaging up things and mailing things out to, um, for commission pieces of uh, commissioned work or when I'm doing happy mail, things of that nature, friend mail, I like to, um, you know, use um, pops of purple, it, whether it's um, the tissue paper I'm using, whether it's the washi tape, whatever, because that's my favorite color. So that's what I kind of do. And then on that same note, same note I um, also grab the different uh, duct tapes that I use to put on the packages. So just kind of get that out. And then instead of taking all these out and showing them to you, I'll just hold it up. Um, I found these in the ribbon. I've never seen this darker purple this year, so I'm really glad I found that. Um, I think I've hauled that one before. They only had one. And then these two are black, and I wanted that for a specific project. So I grabbed two of these, and these are going to go in my fridge once I wash them out and clean them. Because um, the fridge we have here doesn't have that metal crisper drawer like we've always had in our own fridges from houses that we've you know, owned before. And... Um, so whenever we get like lunch meat or cheese or whatever, it kind of just falls over the place and it kind of bugs me. So that's the purpose of these. And I know it's not craft room related, but you know, I bought, I just thought I'd share that with you anyway. This one here, this is a little lanyard I bought and this is cute. I love this color. And there's a specific reason I purchased this and I will announce that in a separate video. So I grabbed that. This will be kind of difficult to show you what it looks like because it's, you know, a hanging thing, but I will... Um, try to get a picture of it hung up somewhere in my house or my room or something and then I'll insert a picture when I go to edit the video and oh it's all tangly no I'm gonna pause the video for just a second if I can't get oh wait I think I got it I had it all straight when I put it up on the belt and I don't think she put it in the bag the way I had it so here we go I got it now so I found this at the front when I was getting ready to check out and it's an acrylic purple butterfly and it's on this bit of wire with plastic around it and it's got like an acrylic bead there and the very, it's like a spiral, the um, cording there and then the bottom it has that larger crystal and then this is like a glass marble and then there's another acrylic bead. So again, this is very difficult to look at this direction. Oh, and there's a flower right here too. But I will take a picture and insert that. But they had uh, quite a few different colors of that one. So let's clip that on my tripod, there we go. And then, um, found these. These, I wanted to try these out as planner bands possibly. Um, this one I got, I love this set because it has two different, you know, shades of the purple and then this kind of teal color because teal is the, um, color for trigeminal neuralgia awareness like breast cancer has pink heart association heart association things or red that kind of thing so teal is the official awareness color for trigeminal neuralgia which is what I have so I'm thinking I might want to put this on as planner bands or something like that some kind of a planner accessory I can't wear these kinds of things anymore which bums me out because of um, my trigeminal neuralgia and I've had brain surgery brain surgery and it um it hurts my head to have things like that on my head anymore so and then these are not craft related either but i grabbed these for my daughter thought i'd share it with you since it's in the hall anyway and then i grabbed the purple one for me i can't use this kind of stuff on my face because of my tn but um i might be able to use these differently somewhere i don't know or maybe i'll alter these <laughs> who knows we'll see they're cute in the purple and they were dollars so i had to get them okay and then i grabbed see five of these because i already have one I like to buy things in even numbers. It's just a weird thing. But um, these are just little photo albums. But I'm going to use these for some craft room organization. So I'll go more into that once I get to that particular project. And I share it with you ladies. Um, these are some candies that fill in my cart. I love nerds. Um, and then the conversation cart. So this really should have been in my um, Valentine's haul. But I'm going to be putting these out. Um, and they're little boxes and I like them because I can pop a couple of these in my daughter's lunch or something like that and she can give some um, to her friends at school. She's in high school but you know she's kids like candy. And then um, and then I have like a little decorative thing I put out um, for Valentine's Day. Just put some little candies in there. Now for the last couple things or last thing is I didn't get all of them out because they're still wrapped in the newspaper from the store but these are some football and this is real glass and there it's a football on there. You can see the strings and then 
you know, it's got the, I, I guess you put your hands there, but now that I have the silhouette cameo, I can actually put my husband's favorite team on here if he wants me to. So it's kind of a little fun thing for him because he does get to go with his friends and watch football, so, and then we can use him for regular drinking glasses too. So, and I like, I like the size of him, and to be honest with you, the strings right here, it gives it a nice grip, so if your glasses got condensation on or something, you have something to kind of hold on to. So that is it, ladies. So um, I will be doing my Valentine's haul video shortly, and I'll get that up for you as well. And um, yeah, so you, should, you, you can just imagine the look on my husband and my daughter's face when I walked back in from the Dollar Tree when all this is the only thing I was supposed to go in there and get. <laughs> so there's just too much purple. I have to grab it. So thanks so much, ladies. I'll see you in my next video. Oh, comment below and let me know if you've hauled any of these things too, because I love to know what you ladies get and then how you use them, especially if, if it's not for the intended purpose, because I love doing that. I will see you next time. Happy scrapping, happy planning, and happy crafting. See you in my next video. Bye.